Eight years into power and the country is on the brink of a catastrophic power crisis. For the first time in 70 years, India is staring at yet another power crisis in less than a year. But as usual, the central government is brushing it under the carpet. In a country where 70% of the electricity is generated using coal, 12 states are ringing alarm bells of a coal shortage. Out of the 173 power plants, 101 have been labelled critical with less than 25% of required stock to generate electricity, while 51 have less than 10% of the stock, and 11 plants running on imported coal have hit critical levels. It is a given that in summers demand for power rises sharply, but as usual, the Modi government failed to anticipate the most obvious outcome and didn't increase domestic production or import enough coal. As a result, India, with one of the largest coal reserves in the world, is left with only enough coal to last a few more days. Coal shortage is another government-made crisis that will cause further stress to the economy. Unemployment increase the burden on citizens as the price of commodities will rise and worst of all, prove to be extremely dangerous for the public as hospitals, schools and businesses will suffer power cuts. Once again, the government has proved it is incapable of governance and only knows how to run bulldozers.